music, especially performing a musical instrument, uh, research has said, uh, touches more parts of the brain. More parts of your brain uh, light up when you're playing a musical instrument than any other thing that you can do in life. Uh, so it, it really works your brain uh, in ways that you can't in any other activity. The neat thing about playing an instrument is, is that you're, you're part of a group. Um, it, covers, it covers every academic subject that's uh, in, the, in, in the rest of their school day. So playing music is science, we have math involved in there. Uh, it's a higher form of, of reading because you've got to be able to take and interpret notation into, thing, into symbols and whatnot that you're going to play through your instrument. So um, it, it covers really a lot of the academic subjects. You know, it's interesting, we probably have the most diverse group and maybe most diverse class in, uh, at Lancaster High School. Uh, it's a large group and it's a very diverse group in terms of um, abilities and interests and uh, we have students participating in all activities, all athletic events. Uh, we have uh, students in um, career tech. We have students that participate in just a number of different courses, which makes us a very unique and diverse group. I think the thing that unites them is this band is kind of like a family, so they've all got that one, that one unique quality, and that's, you know, they're all playing an instrument, they're all part of a group. Um, you know, they're different, obviously, by the, the types of instruments that they, they play. They all have different requirements to them, but uh, we, we have a, a variety of students in here. I, you know, I would say the students get in what they put in. Uh, and uh, they, they can take the course um, and during the school day and get a lot out of uh, participating. It's teamwork, it's um, perseverance. You know, they're having to learn an instrument from fifth grade on. Uh, that's a, an eight year commitment uh, if they stick with it, which we certainly hope they do. And there's very few things anymore that I think students stick with for that many years. It's not instant gratification. So if they can learn that skill of working hard to uh, work towards something that's not gonna pay off tomorrow, uh, it's, a, it's a really valuable thing for life lessons. We start the kids fifth grade, second semester, and it's, it's all sequential. So um, when they're learning to play whole notes, half notes, and quarter notes in fifth grade and sixth grade, and we move on to the next step in, in seventh grade and the next step in eighth grade and so on and get them ready for high school. Um, and, and one of the things that we try and do is, is when they're in high school, we try to uh, say, hey, you know, this doesn't have to stop at the end of your senior year because there's lots of community groups uh, within the, and there's even one here in Lancaster um, that, they, that the kids can participate in. So that's something that can be a lifelong, uh, lifelong ability that they can take and, and use uh, past, their, uh, past their high school years.